It doesn't matter if you're working in the most secured environment, retired or still in school, whether you often use your smartphone or not, everyone is at risk when it comes to cyber crimes and its dangers. This has necessitated the 2019 edition of the Africa's Information Security Conference, ASCAN, to help educate and inform governments, businesses and individuals on how cyber criminals operate and how to disarm them. The conference targets the whole of Africa to tell them about the um, eels of cyber crimes and uh, also to act as a protective barrier for cyber crimes that are happening across the continents. Uh, we also aim to bring into the limelight uh, cyber criminals and, and and offer them an opportunity that uh, crime is not the way. The event organized by Zoix and IT pulled together tech service from across Cameroon to initiate the no one is safe mindset as well as monetizing cyber knowledge. So I use OSINT which is open source intelligence. If your bank account details is on Google, maybe you didn't know that. So I had to prove to people that your private information could be found anywhere on the internet. Les jeunes d'aujourd'hui ont besoin de savoir que dans le domaine de l'informatique, il y a l'aspect sécurité. Et surtout, les jeunes qui ont des diplômes en, 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 en ingénierie réseau, etc. Ils doivent savoir qu'il y a aspect, cet aspect sécurité-là qu'ils doivent prendre en compte quand ils, con, ils conçoivent des réseaux. Où... La présentation qui a été faite tout à l'heure euh, portait sur le bug bounty, naturellement. Et euh, nous avons décrit tout ce, cet écosystème qui euh, facilite l'intégration socio-professionnelle des jeunes et tout le modèle économique qui va derrière. Cybercrime is increasing, cybercriminals are becoming smarter, and its recent statistics show it takes more time to resolve these issues. What then is the first defense mechanism? We need to draw a line between our online presence and our offline presence. Your life online must not always reflect your life offline. For instance, you post on your status, your WhatsApp status, for instance, or Facebook, whatever, like, uh, me and my ever young mom died, I wish you were here. You're just telling me your dad is no more and your mom is the only one left. That's why you see most scammers call us by our names. They call our parents' name and all of that. Where do they get this information from? You give them information. It is of the essence that every individual in this Android generation knows that public data is a weapon of mass destruction and Facebook, WhatsApp, Instagram, Twitter and other social media data can bring down a lifelong reputation in just a split second. Hey. Hey.